Hey guys, Looney here. So this video is going to be explaining how to connect to the new Epoch 1.0.6 server without using a launcher. It's actually very, very easy. Um, so what we're going to do is first, you want to go to e epochmod.com and then you click on downloads and then you click on Arma 2 Daisy Epoch info and downloads and that's going to get you here. Now right here you'll see Epoch 1.0.6 client files. I'll also have that link in the video description so you're going to want to click on that. Um, after that you're going to end up with this zipped folder. You're going to want to unzip it and create just your regular folder and how I did this was I went to the file path where the mods are typically stored so before I had add daisy epoch and add daisy overwatch in here as well so what I did was I cut those before I copied the new epoch one from the 1.0.6 I copied the old ones into a folder called old epoch mods and then I put those in here that way if I ever want to go back and play 1.0.5.1 or overpock or anything like that again I just move this out and then move these ones back in um, so it's really all you gotta do you just unzip this to the at daisy epoch and then you copy it to your your steam steam apps common uh, arma 2 operation arrowhead you just put it right in here after that you just go into you launch Arma 2 straight from Steam. You don't need a launcher or anything. When it comes up, you go to Expansions. What I did first was I just in disabled all the expansions and then clicked OK and then relaunched Arma 2. When it, when it came back on, these are the expansions that I re-enabled. As soon as I relaunched it, it saw the Epoch 1.0.6, so I enabled that. And that was <laughs> oh, that's funny so that's all you need really I mean you just need Arma 2 Daisy Epoch 1.0.6 the British Armed Forces the private military company and Operation Arrow. I mean that's that's it it's super easy after that you click OK it's gonna want you to reboot in order to or restart the Arma 2 in order to enable the mods after that you can search through the server listings by either 1.0.6 or you can search for um, the loony bin or you can go into remote and then type the IP address for the server and the port and that's also going to be in the description like always then you just click OK and there it is and double click it you know how the rest of this goes we'll just run through the whole spiel here anyways there's the pretty little loading screen so that is how to connect without a launcher um, like I said it's pretty cakewalk there's nothing complex about it so if you're having any issues with that whatsoever feel free to hit me up on Steam or in TeamSpeak or reply to the the video whatever works for you I'm more than happy to help people get connected and get them up and going so until next time guys enjoy yourselves out there and peace